Thank you for coming to Wilson Family Circus. I am your host, Jerry. Nice to see you. Uh, I just want to let you know, uh, sorry for how long this video is taking to get out. I know I only got like 20 subscribers right now. I'm hoping to get more. Uh, I got some better uh, unit videos coming. Uh, I was still doing units even though I wasn't posting. Uh, ever since the Rona, uh, and some personal things going on in my life, I kind of had to put YouTube on hold, being that, you know, I'm at the beginning of all this. Uh, it, it's not that important for me right now. But, well, I don't want to say important, because it is important. More or less, I'm going to say it wasn't priority, it didn't take precedence over things going on in my personal life. Uh, I had a family member pass away, and I've been uh, dealing with that. Um, and yeah. Anyways, before I start crying on uh, for everybody, um, but now I'm getting back to doing the YouTube thing. Uh, even though right now in my area in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Uh, there isn't too many units, and a lot of places aren't doing anything. I go on there every once in a while. I haven't really seen too much uh, or anything I really wanted to bid on, especially in this time, considering that resale is down and all that stuff. Uh, it's been a little hard, and I know there's other uh, storage people in my area. Uh, I don't know all of them, but I know a few, and I know you know they're going through some hard times, too, with not having any units. So... Uh, Thankfully, my wife right now is still currently working uh, for Chipotle, so we're getting some money coming in that way at least. Uh, we're hoping soon that uh, this all picks up because they've actually cut back her hours a little bit. She, do, uh, she does get uh, some overtime hours here and there, but uh, not as much as she was getting. And before the whole resale business, you know, kind of went uh, bottoms up for everybody. Uh, you know, everything was doing good. She also didn't have to work out much. Uh, you know, but we'll see. Things will change and hopefully everything gets better. Not just for us, but for all of you. Uh, I know you guys are probably stressing yourselves, having money issues. Uh, hopefully not toilet paper issues. Uh, <laughs> sorry, I think that's funny that people do that. Anyways, I'm down here in the basement. Got some, uh, this is a unit you'll see coming up. Uh, a lot of fun stuff in there. Uh, give you a little sneak peek. Yep. Trying to do, I'm doing this on my phone. Okay. Got some coach flip-flops or no, those, yeah, those are the flip-flops. I thought those were coach shoes, but unfortunately they're not. Uh, some coach purses as well, right here. You'll see that later. Um, some other unique things, some stuff from other units and so forth. Uh, still got some of that stuff. Uh, currently, the way that I used to uh, usually sell things, uh, flea market is down right now. So, uh, hopefully that is able to turn around soon and come back as well. Uh, supposedly we're starting to hit that crest to come back down, but we'll see. Uh, I got my own personal views on that, but that's a whole nother issue. Uh, got some jewelry here from another unit, so we'll get on that. Uh, also, to give you an update, the trailer that I've been using had some issues with it. Uh, the uh, little pigtail for the connector that goes into the back of my Jeep um, kind of, uh, took a crap on us on the last unit, and, uh, unfortunately, Figgy isn't with me anymore, um, there's some, uh, other reasons there, uh, why he's no longer working for me, but, uh, he's gone now, so I gotta find somebody else to help out, um, we'll see what happens there, I got a few friends that help me out here and there, you know, maybe hauling or going through it or whatnot. The wife helps too, so. 
but anyways to get you to what you wanted to see uh this unit was one of the it was the last of the four from before uh nothing too grand about it it was just kind of a mediocre unit uh i I took a gamble on it being that I was going all that way. I wasn't going to go out there for, you know, one or two units. I was going to go out for the whole shebang, but, um, this is the, uh, last unit of that four parter, uh, at the U-Haul facility and, uh, Greensburg or something like that. Uh, forget where it was. Uh, I'll say it in the video here in a second. So tell me what you think. Uh, please don't forget to hit, that subscribe button like the video bring the bell notification if you want to see more and we'll get on to this and then i'll see you for the outro all right here we are at 234 this is the last unit here at the u-hauls uh moving of storage in greensburg I haven't taken this off so i'm saving that for the video here let's go ahead and break that there we go just a little bit of elbow grease. Yep, just a little bit. All right. You ready to see what's in this? Here we go. Oh. You wanted to come back down on me. All right, so this is what we got in here. All right. We got a briefcase that's popped open. A couple totes. I see some Christmas decorations. Those are going right in the your bucket. The bucket bucket. I got a big vapor up thing. I got some purses here. Purses there. Open. Nope. All right. So I got some pictures and stuff like that. We'll get some of this on the truck loaded up and we'll go through the stuff that I think is important and that you guys might want to see. And we'll be back momentarily. All right, so we got a few mirrors. Uh, they're kind of okay. They're not great, but I like the one with the flowers on it. It could have been done a little better. But I have a question for you. This is a black and record uh, back. A little bit black and decker drill. Uh, I'm gonna say no. Why do you think that? Because who really has a plug-in drill anymore? True, true. But this is a new box, I mean. Because mm, it looks like an old person's thing. Old person's unit. Alright. Well, you're right. It's fashion footwear from Splash. Well, it looks like something Grandma would throw at you when she was upset. Yeah. Well, it's cork and wood. Looks like pine. It's a set, so I mean that works. Uh, I took a gamble on this unit. I only paid ten bucks for this unit, so I wasn't expecting to see a lot out of it. Okay. This is, this is an extendable ruler uh, for uh, paint roller. That's cool. I don't know if it's feeling good, but we'll see. Uh, let's see here. Basket broken. Let's see here. There are some nice prints, like this one here. The Hertfordshire Hunt of 1839. Probably want to reframe that one, huh? Maybe. Or I could let somebody else do it. James Pullen, 1792 to 1867. And doesn't say anything about it on the back, though. All right, there's that one. And we got this one. This looks like Montreal, New York, Toronto. Yeah, this ain't, this is recent because it's got the barcode, but it might be vintage, I don't know. This is definitely vintage. It's got some weight to it. That's something you would see in like an 80s living room. 
I don't know if anybody would want that, but... Yeah, there's nothing on the back. What do we got here? It's a mirror. Hey. Yeah, if you can't tell, I'm not too excited about this unit. I did only spend $10 on it, and I might be able to get that back. We'll see. I've only been on this side of the unit, so... What's this? And it's a mirror. So we got another mirror. And that's a total of five mirrors. And, oh. Oh, and it's got a hole in it. It's got a hole in it. And it's, it's signed, but it's got a hole in it. Oh, well. That's garbage. Best picture in the world. Say cheese. Alright. Alright. This one is a print. It's the Ebbing. It's a repop. Made in USA. Doesn't have a price on it, but there is no barcode, so this might be a vintage pop, but I don't see it bringing in any money. What do we got here? This is a repop. And Claire Jane or Jane Claire. Drip Drop. Avatar Galleries. And what do we got? Another mirror? Yep. Another mirror. I'm not breaking a mirror. Not today. Well, at least not by my hand. And you, you can break it back. And something you would find at an 80s Target. Yep. So, nothing good there. Let's see here. Now, we got some cruddy Adidas. Garbage. Big paper of thing. Garbage. Let's go to this bag. Let's see. Give me something good. Give me something good. I'm hoping that in this box and in that box is where I'm making my money. That's where I'm hoping I'm making my money. We got talcum powder, a belt, some type of inhaler cartridge. I think it said on butyrol. We have a book. Hannah's Town. How old is this? Another Pennsylvania book. Okay, so this certainly is vintage, not antique. Looking for a copyright. We're going to throw that in there. Oh, Cleveland, 1973. That might have something to it. Might not. Makeup 
Shorts. You wear short shorts. This will fit you. Come on. It'll fit you. It ain't gonna fit me. I'm fat. Just, I'm button them. You put them on. And honestly, I'm not seeing anything in here. Nothing. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Oh, there's a liquor store bag. And. Mail, band aids, and an adver inhaler. And we got another purse. We got two purses. Let's see. Anything good? Nope. But it looks like garbage. Looks like trash. Ah, cigarette smoker. Almost thought I found a unicorn horn. It would have been the second one today. And more makeup. I don't know, that purse might be resellable. And there's no Brahma in here. Brahma bowl. Alrighty. Clean. What we got in here? We got a lint roller, mail, and a bottle. Ooh. Ah, something to a wind chime. This looks like kitchen stuff. And Christmas stuff. Kitchen and Christmas. Woo! Bottle rockets. Is that a cookie jar? Yep, that's a uh, snowman cookie jar. But I found bottle rockets. Want to light one off? Not here. Not in here, but outside of the unit? Come on. No, 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 no. <laughs> Beads? I think it's for like a Christmas tree decoration beads. Alright, there's some plates down there. More Christmas stuff. Right. I'm gonna have to take this over for a little more. Like some nice prints. Yeah, that's definitely a print. I can't read the signature. There's little pieces of duct tape on the back, but I don't know. We'll see. Maybe. And what's this? Something with German. I guess that was supposed to be in there. That's in German too. Du bist bomb. Du fick mich. Du hast. Du hast mich. Alright. Make this video quick and painless. Although it's kind of going boring, I'm not finding anything funny or good or anything. We got a little cat dish, and that's like something you get at the dollar store. Got 
That broke. There's Christmas houses in there. Those might be worth something. Christmas garlic. And we got a frog. Hello, big bird. Yeah. I can't do that voice. I've tried so many times to try and do that voice. This thing's heavy. Feel that. This thing's heavy. There's a warehouse back here behind the camera. You gotta, oh, you gotta squeeze the tail, but he doesn't do anything, he's dead. They killed Rudolph. How rude. And we got a little black cat joker thing. Sugarloaf toys. You gotta play to get them. I don't know what that means. Probably from like an arcade or something. Usually something that's Oh, we got a fancy Santa. And he's dead. Rock and roll Santa. Another Santa Christmas lights. Maybe they work. Maybe they don't. Hey, boo -boo. What we got? There? Pine cone. Christmas cloth. Clock. Christmas blocking. This is all Christmas stuff. Yeah, that's all Christmas. That's Christmas balls, yeah. So, what I'm hoping on is in this and that, there's something worth it. So, this, there's something to do with the phone that doesn't work. Okay. All right. Mutual Aid EMS, Westmoreland County. Right. Figures, because that's where we're at. Dab Meister piles, whatever. I don't know beer. Uh, we got a food processor somewhere. That's uh, a German beer. There's something German. Two piece doily curtain set. There's another one. Oh, well, that's what that was. Well, it's garbage now. I'm just freaking plug. What do we got here? Hey! There's like 10% of my prop. Or my. What I put on the unit. I don't know, we'll see. There's stuff wrapped up down here. We're gonna get that back in here. Let's see here. Christmas plates. Hey, this is in there. The Revlon Amber Waves. Anybody want some galoshes? The microwave cookbook. this all worth it this is the last thing I'm opening and then I'm ending the video because there's nothing here I don't think the pictures might be worth something you ready yep what do you think it is magnets no ornaments made in China 
All right, so that's it for this unit. There's, there's, this is only a $10 unit. I wasn't expecting to get anything out of it, but I figure while I'm here, give it a shot. I took a risk on another unit. The unit you saw with the CDs, uh, that big thing of CDs in the last video. Um, that unit was 30 bucks. I got that unit for 30 bucks. Uh, the one with the unicorn horn, that was 20. And then the first one you saw was 50. So, all in all, did I make my money back? I think so. Uh, we'll just have to see. But as far as this goes, this one was a dud. So, I mean, I'm, I make something off of it. I'm not trying to. This was just for fun. Just to see what I could get. All right. Oh, I was, that was recording. Okay. Uh, <laughs> thank you for watching the video. I got two more units coming up. Uh, those will be out. One will be out in a couple days. The other one's going to be out a couple days after that. I'm going to try and upload three times a week. It's probably going to end up being two, but I'm going to try for three. We'll see what happens. Uh, and then we'll go from there. I got some other video ideas I'm going to come out with. Uh, maybe upload a little more often we'll see it all depends on what happens i'm going to do, go over some highlighted stuff uh with what i got in these units such as that bag of jewelry sitting right there and then maybe some stuff in here you know maybe these guys can let me know uh most of the good stuff has already been uh sorted through and it's been put into uh storage containers for sale at the flea market or ebay um eBay is going to happen soon. Um, I had some issues dealing with that because I never really used eBay before. So I'm trying to get familiar with it. We'll see what happens. I got some crud on there. Hold on. There we go. All right. Anyways, thank you for coming. Thank you for watching the video. Please like, subscribe, share, and ring that bell for notifications if you like what you saw. And don't worry, things are about to get a little more interesting. So return. If you don't subscribe today, I hope you subscribe on the next videos because those videos are going to be a lot more interesting than this one. All right. You have a good day. Enjoy. Hope everybody's safe during the Rona. I'll see you on the next video.